Today, I want to share a recipe on steamboat dipping sauce. It is slightly sweet, tangy, and non-spicy, and goes perfectly well with boiled meat in a steamboat. This recipe is for six servings. The ingredients needed are two red chilies, cilantro stalks, four cloves of garlic, peel and washed, one tablespoon of roasted sesame seeds, eight tablespoon of chili sauce, 2 tablespoon of black sesame oil, 2 tablespoon of sugar, 3 tablespoon of tamarind juice. The full list of ingredients is in the Seymour link. In a hand blender, add all the garlic, cut the red chili into the blender. Leaving out the stalks. Blend both garlic and chili together until they become a fine paste. Scrape all the chili from the blender. In a small pot, add 8 tablespoons of chili sauce. Scraping the tablespoon as well. Add all the chili garlic paste, tamarind juice, and sugar. Give it a quick stir to mix all the ingredients together until very well combined. Give it a taste. Delicious! Add 1 tablespoon of black sesame oil for fragrance and stir. Switch on the heat to medium. Put the pot on the stove. Let it come to a boil, stirring often. We will apply a little bit of heat to the mixture. This mixes the flavor together and increases the lifespan of the sauce so that it lasts longer. After about 4 minutes, the chili mixture has come to a boil. Give it a taste. The other flavors are very prominent now and the sesame oil is not very strong. Add another 1 tablespoon of sesame oil and give it a mix. Switch off the heat, add some chopped cilantro leaves and all the toasted sesame seed. Mix vigorously to combine. Pour all the sauce into the heat-proof serving bowl. Garnish with some cilantro leaves and toasted sesame seed. Now our steamboat dipping sauce is ready to be served. This sauce can be stored in an airtight container in the fridge for up to 4 to 5 days. If preferred, chopped garlic and chopped green chili can be added for an extra spicy and garlicky taste. Enjoy it by dipping in some just cooked boy meat. So delicious! Thank you for watching. Please like and share if you have enjoyed the video. This is Home Cooking with Somjit. Thank you and bye-bye!